Feden Mukwata says that the sodomy laws did not criminalize anal sex between a man and a woman and instead only criminalized anal sex between two men. The court concluded that it is unconstitutional and unfairly discriminates against homosexuals. A differentiation between people and is that differentiation, if there is, is that differentiation on what is it based basically and is it linked to any legitimate governmental purpose or objective? Now, when you unravel that, that uh, test, and, uh, the, as the court did, and applied it to the facts of the case that of the applicant in this, in this matter, it then found that there's a differentiation between, between, between people. Now, you would, you would recall when we defined the act of sodomy, it's, it's, it's in, it, like any other criminal offense. It's an act, first of all. It means people, it's only people can do that act. So the differentiation comes in when it's only criminal when men perform this act. It's not criminal when women or a man and a woman uh, perform the act. Article 25 of the Constitution provides for any aggrieved person when their rights are violated, as demonstrated by this case. As for this background, the court has approached and asked to determine whether or not the said offences were unfairly discriminating against gay community and depriving them of the right to equality and dignity. Ingrid Hesselman of the Ombudsman's Office says the ruling will allow the gay community freedom of expression as well as freedom of association without being stigmatized. Um, basically what these offences, what they are and if they discriminate um, against him. And so the court in essence found that um, the, these criminal offences are indeed um, discriminatory and therefore they were declared unconstitutional and invalid and so were the other statutory provisions um, that Fedden alluded to earlier that basically talks about uh, a, essentially a, a charge on or conviction of sodomy. Same-sex is no longer a criminal offence. However, same-sex marriage is not legalised in the country with a court judgment still pending.